Canva is bumping up their prices by 300%. I'm gonna break it down for you. I am right now on a Canva Pro subscription. I've just renewed that subscription, not only maybe like two weeks ago. Then I got this email last week. Now, right now on a Pro subscription, you can have up to four people on that one plan. Obviously, they're changing that. They just haven't said anything about it until now. So apparently, so that they can keep improving Canva and keep investing in their AI, they have changed their Canva Teams plan to $100 per year per person. And you have to have a minimum of three people. So as of July next year, the pro plan, because I have three people, will automatically change to a Teams plan. You'll get a 40% discount from July 2025 to July 2026, or whenever your date renews. So that means that's 60 bucks per person. But then come your renewal in 2026, you will pay a hundred bucks per person. Now you might be asking Clem, why would you even bother with the Teams plan? Why can't you just downgrade to Pro? Let's have a look at the Pro plan then, now that the prices have increased on the website. So Teams plan, minimum of three people, AKA 400 bucks a year. That's the new price. The Pro plan will be 165 bucks per year for one person. So a team of two would have to pay that price twice and have individual logins. Tools like Canva are lifelines for small businesses. Small businesses and contractors rely on tools like Canva for affordable resources like graphic design. Such a steep increase just puts these tools out of reach and just forces these small business entities to cut corners and cut quality in their designs. Yet all social media platforms, websites, and even certain industries expect a level of finesse and elegance that Canva can give. And given small businesses are the backbone of an economy, I feel like it's the responsibility of tools like Canva to keep these tools accessible. So maybe it might be time to actually shop around for a pretty decent and affordable competitor compared to Canva. Let me know what you think and if you've got any suggestions on what platform I should explore.